retainer. We're terribly sorry. We just... <clears throat> One merely jests. One felt your presence the moment you set foot upon this land. Wow. You adept I really are impressive. Come here to chat about the old times with Ganyu. It looks like you get along quite well. <sighs> ah, a matter leaves you at an impasse then. Not to worry. One is exceptional at seeking avenues for conversation. One has been one's own companion in idle talk for many a year. Ah, yes. Since you are Ganyu's friends, tales from her youth shall one apprise you of, perhaps? Oh, Cloud Retainer. <sighs> Nothing to be ashamed of. You were so cute as a child. One is most certain that your friends would like to hear of it. Oh, Paimon wants to hear it! Uh... <laughs> Little Gon you loved when the horns on the top of her head were caressed. When one was still taking care of her, one was pestered most often to touch her horns. She was elsewise loath to sleep. Plump she was back then. Why, when she stumbled while we ascended the mountain, she would roll down to the bottom like a little ball. <laughs> the day Ganyu bumped into a pilgrim was the first time she saw a real human in the flesh. So fearful she was that she hid in a rock's cleft for two days and nights. One found her wailing of a monster she had seen. <laughs> Cloud Retainer? Ugh, forget it. It's about time for my training. I will take my leave. Ah, one's intention was merely to relieve the awkward tension. And you did the exact opposite. Impressive. Be that so? Huh. But returning to Ganyu, most gladdened one is of your arrival. One cannot help but feel that remaining in Jueyun Karst shall not be good for her. One will tell you more about her, if you should permit it. <laughs> 